Whoa! Guys, that was amazing. But what's more amazing, guys, is that we finally hit 250,000 subscribers. Now, I have a new challenge for you. Our brand new goal is 500,000 subscribers. So before this video gets started, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and don't forget to click that post notification bell for more videos and live streams. Now I gotta go guys, I'm late for my race, I'll see you in the video! Yo, before we start this video, like check this out guys, I, uh, the brand new like format of Roblox actually looks really cool. I don't like when things just update out of nowhere. But this thing actually likes like look really really cool like check this out when we go on and hover over a game You can actually click on the trailer actually never mind. It just put me through straight to the game <laughs> That is actually really cool though. I like that But here we are back in Roblox car dealership tycoon guys because today We are going to be doing the ultimate hypercar meetup. Yes another meetup guys But this time we got some new hypercars that I do want to show you guys and I want to see some people's creativity and what they do to their brand new Bugatti Mistral or CC850, guys. Now, let's get this video started. All right, we are in here right now. And you guys can see that I have all of the cars, 225 out of 229. Actually, I just lied. I don't have all, I don't have all of them. But I do have the newest one, guys, the most important ones. We have the brand new CC850. And also, we have the brand new Bugatti Mistral, guys. And also, if you guys have completed uh, the uh, Season 1 challenge, let me know in the comments down below. That's very, very impressive that you guys have done that already. I know it's probably not a lot, but your boy hasn't even completed the second car yet. So, we're going to bring out the Bugatti Mistral on the car meet right now. But you know what? Let me go ahead and make it car meet official. I kind of wanted to uh, put some mods on it. We got it already dropped down. Let's go ahead and add some uh, race tires on it. We don't need off-road tires anymore. Uh, I kind of want to make it a very, very cool color. Making it all black will make it look like the La Venture Nior. So I kind of want to go away from that. Let's go with like maybe a reddish color or we can even go with like a highlighted color. That's pretty cool. Or we can even go with the yellow one. We Like how we are in the beginning. The green ones are cool too. But the yellow ones are actually getting to me. The gold one's nice. What about a tan one? Ooh, look at that. And then a purple one, a pink one. And then, of course, uh, we got a very pink one. <laughs> the gray looks really cool. Let me go put the gray on. The yellow is actually a really great contrast to that. The wheels, it's already black. So we can keep it as is. The interior, though, we can actually have two different interiors if we wanted to. I kind of want to go with something a little bit more brighter. Let's go with a red. And then let's go with a... Can we go all red on this? Or red and black? Yo, that's actually really, really cool. Or we can even go matching gray with the red. And the calipers, guys, we got to go with the red, of course. And check this out. Ooh, that is so cool. That's clean right there. That is really, really nice. I don't have the wing up. We could have it up too. There we go. So it looks so much better when we're displaying it. I can't wait till the OG wrap comes out on this car. I don't know what it is going to be. But hopefully it's a very cool wrap. But rate my Bugatti Mistral, guys. I know it's a little bit plain, but rate it for me. Give me like a 1 out of 10. I'll probably even get like a 6 or like a, a 0. But just rate it for me. I think this looks very very nice let's go ahead and park in here already we should have some people coming in pretty soon with their brand new hyper cars actually let's go park by the the brand new ferris wheel all right looks like they're coming in right now we see a bunch of yes goes okay we see one chendo diechi over here we got some more people coming oh he just switched to lava and chua nyor i see you my boy i see you all right it's starting to shake up a little bit oh my gosh there's so many cars in here right now this is so cool i'm gonna say welcome to the hypercar meetup no revving <laughs> oh my gosh this is so cool we got some fans in here as well what's going on guys oh wait what happened to that car that car is just rolling off hey you forgot to turn off your emergency brake oh my gosh looks like one just came in yo that is so sick oh my gosh that's the very last one you can actually get that is so cool i need to get that i have to need, i have to get that that is so sick all right just making sure everybody here are hyper cars okay 
No supercars. I don't know. Would you consider this as a hypercar? Hmm. I don't know. I, I'll have to see. I'll have to see. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe he'll get disqualified for not being a hypercar. Technically, I don't think this is a hypercar. All right. Whose car is this? Whose car is this? This is not supposed to be. Not supposed to be right here. This is a... Uh, oh, there we go. He swapped it out. Okay. That's a little bit better. That's an Elva right there. That is nice. Oh, my gosh. That's one of the first Elvas I've seen. All right. I told everybody to stand by their car because we're about to start raiding the best hypercar so far everyone has got very cool hypercars out here i see some cc 850s some bugatti veyrons that's actually really cool i have not seen anybody with a bugatti veyron out here just because they think it's a little bit older car so big props to you so let's go ahead and start all the way over here we got king king's car or king scar mm, that's actually a good one is it king's car or King Scar. I don't know. Are you talking about your Scar, my boy? Or are you talking about a car? But I see you, though. I like that fit you got going on. Bulls 23. Reminds me of childhood, man. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we got that big chain. And you got this blacked out Yesco right over here with the black calipers, the black rims, and then the black paint job. I like that wing on the back, too, my boy. I'm going to have to give it a... Uh, I'm going to have to give it an 8. Okay, I'm not going to be lying to you. I'm going to give you an 8 out of 10. It's sleek. I like the sleek design. And I'm only giving him an 8 because he added a cool wing to it. If it wasn't, you know, if there wasn't a wing, I probably would have given him like a 7, uh, you know, or a 6 and a half. So good job, my boy. I'm going to give you a 7. Or oh, actually, I'm going to give you an 8. I'll give you an 8. All right, we got this Bugatti Mistral right over here. I should give him a 10 for wearing that fresh shirt on. The gold status T Pro merch. I see you, my boy, with them shades and that hair, though. And he's got the Bugatti Mistral right over here on. I think this is like a highlight color right here. This is nice. We got a highlight color with a highlight caliper and then the yellow interior. That's actually really, really nice right here. And then for the rims, it looks like he did it blacked out rims on that one. Good job, my boy. I'm going to give you a 9. And I'm only giving you a 9 just because you're wearing that shirt right there. Very nice. All right, we got a McLaren Elva right here. Kind of looks like an orange dreamsicle. I'm going to call that the orange dreamsicle right over here. I'm going to give this guy a 9. I'm going to give you guys a 9 for this one right here. And then this one right here, ah, uh, he said sub to T Pro. Ooh, thank you for that. I'm going to give you a 9 as well just for the creativity. I like the orange and white interior with the black seats i see that and the wing on it this actually looks a lot more aggressive now so this one's pretty nice also comment down below is the mclaren elva a hypercar or or no let me know i want to know what your guys's response is is this a hypercar or a supercar all right we got the bugatti bullied right over here with the og wrap i see you my boy i'm gonna give you an extra point for the og wrap but i'm gonna have to give you uh, no points on creativity because you know the OG rap is uh, one of the most seen camos in this game But I'm gonna give you an 8 my boy. I'll give you an 8 on that one. Ooh, Mr. Football guy over here. We got a Yeetus <laughs> 20070 right over here. We got a green Yesco absolute with an amazing wing and red calipers I see you going with the with the watermelon scheme my boy. I like that. I just wish this had an interior on it i think that'll be like really really cool but this one not bad not bad i'll give you like uh i'll give you like an eight all right i'll give you an eight for this it looks nice the wing looks nice but i wish uh you know it would have been a little bit better if there was an interior i think the only way that this could be a perfect 10 is if it was a different color like a purple to yellow color scheme I think that would have been a little bit better, but this one's a red and green. Pretty basic, but very, 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 very nice. Woo, look at Cool Bro 27L right over here. I like them shades, my boy. The Xbox shades. I see you, and I see you got that T Pro merch on the sleeveless one. Oh, extra points for that. And he's got this cool color scheme right over here. He's got a custom wing on the Bugatti Mistral. He's also got a green interior matching with the, oh my gosh, with the green rims. He is, he is brave for that. He's also got red calipers and a cyan or Miami blue exterior. I'm going to have to give you a 10 out of this one just because, my boy, you're matching with your car and you got yourself some cool shades and the Xbox 
and all this just all matches right now this is so cool i like it oh my gosh he said what oh wait <laughs> i'm gonna say 10 oh my boy with the oh <laughs> he's doing the little fish move so he's got the braves the atlanta braves jersey on with the cuban necklace and the vans hat i see you my boy and he's also got a red and black lava junior with the white and red interior and a custom wing that looks so cool and even white rims what this is actually really really cool this one is nice and plus he matches with the car too i'm gonna give him a 10 as well this one is very very nice right here i like that one i wish my lava chono looks like that but that is so nice all right my boy <laughs> my boy initial drifter too he's got the drifter haircut the drifter shades the drifter smile but he's got a Lamborghini shirt on with the Agera RS. I don't know how I feel about that. But it looks like he's got the cyan blue with the carbon fiber in white. Very basic. I'm going to have to give him a 7 on this one. Just because it is a very basic color. Nothing added. But good job, my boy. All right. This is mine right here, guys. I want you to rate it in the comment down below. What do you guys rate my Lava Junior? I got the red calipers right here with the wing extended out and then also blacked out rims and the red and gray interior. Comment down below. The interior looks so nice from this perspective right over here, guys. So, and I also like the gray exterior. I think I'm going to keep it just like that. That actually is a really good color right there. Oh my gosh. Check this guy out. What? Okay, so he got the Jesco with the interior. This is not the absolute. This is the regular Jesco right here. And he got a cool outfit on. And he's got this sleek black with all the carbon fiber and the red interior with the white rims. Oh my gosh. And then the secondary color going with white as well matching the rims and the red interior with the carbon fiber i'm gonna have to give you a 10 my boy i'm gonna have to give you a 10. this is really really creative right here Ooh, king overload and i see that he's got the matching fit with the interior this is what i like to see he's got the gray exterior oh with the golden rims dude and of course we got the carbon fiber and we got ourselves a very very cool wing in the back that already is standard but the interior the golden interior just matches all of it i'm gonna give him a 10 too this is nice i like the fit with the car that's actually really cool and then right over here we got a chendo diachi he says i grinded so hard for this car once i uh once it first came out og here oh okay we got an og fan over there that's plus one that's an extra point for being og my boy i like that flower <laughs> on your mouth right there and then we also got this Chendo Diachi. We got this blue color right here. Really nice blacked out rims with the red calipers. I like how he went with the uh, blue with the red calipers. He didn't go with the blue and blue. So he added a little bit more creativity on this one. Uh, I just wish it had an interior. But of course that's not his fault. But with being an OG, I'm going to give him an 8. I'm going to give him an 8 for this car. I wish he would have done a little bit better color. But you know what? That is a pretty sleek color as well. Woo! Look at this guy. He looks just like a racer. Oh my gosh. With the fit. I see you, my boy. I like this right here. This is a very nice color combo with a darker caliper. Okay, I just wish I had an interior. But this is really nice with the exterior. Uh, it looks kind of like Miami blue with the custom wing on it. I'm going to have to give him an 8 as well. I would give him an extra point for the outfit. But you know what? It's... uh. It's still pretty good. All right. We got two more cars right over here. And we got a guy with the... I like that fit right there. Is that the Twitter bird right there? Man of goodness. Okay. I like those shoes too. And he's got the CC850. He's the only one so far I've seen with the CC850. He's got the red with the white interior and a custom wing. And I think those are... Oh, no. Those are the regular rims right there. But this looks very, very nice right here. He's even got that gold inside too. I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. Just because it looks really, really good with the custom wing and the red and white interior right there. Pretty cool. And then last but not least, guys, we got this Bugatti Devo right here. I'm going to be honest. This is really, really nice right here. Just the fact that the Bugatti Devo already has so much details. Like, check this out, guys. He's got the red secondary color with the red tail lights. Of course, the tail lights are red. And also, look at the wheels. 
Look at the rims, white rims with the red trim on it. That is so sick. And of course, it matches with the with the uh, with the flag as well, the French flag. Uh, and then, of course, we also got no interior, but that's not his fault. But this looks very, very nice and aggressive. I'm gonna give it eight ten out of ten. This is so beautiful right here. But out of all these cars, guys, let me know which one is your favorite. Uh, you know what? Should we race it? I think we should like have like a simple race real quick. All right, here we go, guys. Check this out. All the hyper cars racing right now. Of course, I'm driving my Bugatti Mistral right over here. This is so fun. I can't wait to do another live stream with you guys because last week's live stream was so fun. And I really, really enjoy it and missed it. Like, just playing with these guys right now is absolutely super fun and I love it. But you guys, comment down below what you guys think about this whole hypercar meetup. Oh my gosh, these guys are crashing into the wall. Let me know who won the hypercar meetup. If your boy T Pro won, let me know. I would really appreciate that. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys want me to do a, another meetup video, let me know what of what. I know there's some like brand new cars that just came out lately. And I kind of want to do like an F1 meetup. I kind of want to do like an ATV Ultimate Race. I want you guys to comment out what ideas I should do for a video. And whoever gets the most likes, on their comment i would probably do a video on that so if you guys have any ideas on videos comment down below and if people like the idea i will do it look at the bugatti mistral look at my bugatti mistral from the interior tell me this is not the winner of the whole competition tell me it's not <laughs> all right we're gonna go ahead and finish this race with the w my boy just landed in the water <laughs> But that is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.